Chest and tutorial workout. How bad do you want to work? You can really get a great burn. If you're, you keep going, you bang out the reps as quick as you can, you should be toasted when you're done. All right, first one, Liberts, um, where your body rock equalizer. What we're doing is we're doing a push up. You want your feet right behind you. You want your weight on your toes. After you're done your push up, you're gonna come up, swing the feet right in front, and you're gonna do a tricep dip, okay? Try not to put too much strain on your shoulders. Get down as far as you can on the dip and then come right back up. So you're gonna do 25 of these. One push up, one dip. That counts as one rep, okay? Second exercise. Um, we did core again. So feet up on the equalizer. You're gonna do 25 straight on. Okay, straight on. You should feel this in the lower part of your abs. You wanna kick the knee right up as far as you can get it. Reset and come back. Okay, so you're gonna do 25 of those. If you don't have an equalizer at home, you can use a couch, you can use a chair, something stable. Um, and when your feet are actually up on top of the equalizer, try not to, uh, to put a lot of weight on the top of your feet, okay? So you, you really wanna keep this portion of your foot that's up here, you wanna keep it light. Okay, no pun intended. Um, next exercise. My jokes are funny. <laughs> uh, next exercise. So we got a crawling push up or a catwalk push up. Again, this is going to be for core and it's going to be for your upper body. So um, you're going to get down in a push up position. You're going to do the push up. You're going to walk out and then you're going to do a few quick steps behind you, push up again, and you're gonna reach out, okay? So this is really important to keep your core tight, um, the short, short choppy steps uh, so you can catch up, then you're gonna reset and walk again. Now if this is too hard for you, no problem, do the push up from your knees, okay? Come up, reach up, then get up, do a little bit of a walk, Get back down on your knees and then do it that way. So you want 25 of those. Your core should be burning, your chest should be burning, so it's really great for your upper body. You're also gonna target some of your triceps, just like we did on the first exercise. So it's all good, so we don't have it flapping in the wind. All right, boogie ball. You're gonna do side to side. Um, you're gonna have a slight bend in the knees. You're gonna come up. You're gonna have the oogie ball on the outside of the ankle, and then you're gonna come back up and do the other side. All right, you're gonna crunch right up, get the knees right up, and it's just a sw slight twist to each side, okay? So that's all you're doing. Get a good stretch when you're back here so you get a really good, uh, you get a really good stretch in the abs. So you can come right up and exhaling at the top. Okay, last exercise. So, it's weighted. If you have weights at home, great. Uh, I'll show you some alternatives if you don't have weights at home. So what we're gonna do is you're gonna grab your weights. Um, you can do this on the floor if you don't have a bench as well. And you're gonna just come out. You're gonna do a press. You're gonna turn the weights in at the top, which sets you actually up for a fly. So you're gonna come in with the fly, get nice and wide, like you're hugging a tree almost. Okay, you don't wanna come all the way down where you're actually, you know, stretching your shoulders. That's not good, so you wanna have it where it's nice and comfortable, where you are getting a stretch. And then you're gonna come right back up, turning the weights the opposite way. So you're actually getting, you know, a nice burn on the inner side of the inner half of the chest as well. So I'll show you in quick, quick motion here, up, Turn, fly, turn. So you're gonna do 25 of those as well. Now you don't have weights and you're like, what can I do for something alternative? I got no weights, I got no bench. Well, I'm gonna show you, okay? So if you have paper towels at home, if you have magazine covers at home, um, you can use these, okay? So you can actually put 
magazine covers underneath your hands, okay? And you can actually do, um, you can do a push up and you could fly it over with something underneath, okay? So you can do fly push ups um, and then you can go down and do a push up as well. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna do a push up, come up, fly to one side, slide your hand back through, push up, and then you're gonna fly to the other side. So you actually can do something if you're just doing body weight, okay? If you need to do a few more than 25 to get a really good burn, no problem. And that is the workout. So 25 reps of each, let me know how you did, and uh, we'll be back with you again very shortly.